Hi guys. So as a part of this video, I'm going to talk about what do you mean by black box testing. So black box testing is nothing but testing the functionality of an application without looking into the internal code like how it is written is called as black box testing. So black box testing is nothing but testing the functionality of an application without actually looking at the code that is called as black box testing. As the name suggests, it is a black box testing. The definition which I'm going to give now, it is just for your reference. Do not tell to anyone. I am giving this definition only for you to keep it in your mind. So black box testing, how the name has come into the picture. The meaning is there is a box which is black. Inside that there is a code like how the application is working. And now you need to test the application without looking into the code. So inside that there is a code written. So code is not visible to you. You are testing the application, but code is not visible to you. So that is why black box testing it is called as. So final definition. So testing the functionality of an application without looking into the internal code structure that is called as black box testing. Very simple definition guys. Do not break your head. It is one of the simple topic in software testing. Black box testing is nothing but the testing which test engineers are doing it but without looking into the code like how developers have written. So you are testing the application without looking into the code how it is written and that is called as black box testing. In black box testing the code will not be visible like you need to test the application and the, without looking into the code code won't be visible to you and you need to test that application. It is mainly done by test engineers. It is 95% done by test engineers. So here test engineer will take the application and he will test the application. He will test the functionality of an application based on the customer's requirement specification and he will start testing the application. And the programming knowledge is not at all required to do black box testing. And the thing you need to keep in your mind is you do black box testing with the help of the customer requirement specification. So you look into the requirement and you start testing your application. And this is all about black box testing. Now the question arises, how do you do black box testing? Guys, if you have this doubt now, I would request you guys to watch my STLC video. But in case you want me to tell something about how to do black box testing, I would say that you do black box testing by looking into the requirement specification that you would have received from your company. So you will take the requirement specification and then you will start writing your test cases. When you are writing test cases, you will write all the possibilities of inputs that you are going to give to your software or your application. And while writing test cases, you will give like what is the expected behavior, right? For each and every input, you will give what is the expected behavior. And finally, you will start testing your application. While testing the application, based on the inputs, you will whatever the output you have received the actual output which you have received you will compare that output with the expected output and you will say whether your test case is passed or fail in case your test case is passed you will mark it as passed in case the actual output which you are getting is not matching with the expected output you will raise a bug and you will assign the bug to the developer developer will fix it he will give a fix to you, you have to retest it and finally you need to cover all the bug retesting and finally your full test cases will be executed. So this is all about how to do black box testing. And now the question arises, what are the types of black box testing? So guys, according to the ISTQB or International Software Testing Qualification Board, the types of your black box testing are classified into three types. And the first type of your black box testing is called as functional testing and then your non-functional testing and then finally your regression testing. So I won't go deeper into what exactly is your functional testing, non-functional testing and regression testing as I have already uploaded the videos on it. If you really want to know what exactly is functional and non-functional testing, I have already uploaded the video. Go and watch it now. In case you don't know what do you mean by regression testing, I have already uploaded the video. Go and please watch it now. On a short note, your functional testing is nothing but any testing that you do according to the functional requirement it is. If it is according to the functional requirement, that is called as your 
functional testing and if you ask me what exactly is non-functional testing then I would tell you that any testing that is on the performance side or scalability side or stability side that is called as non-functional testing and if you ask me what do you mean by regression testing so as you guys know if you guys don't know I, I am telling you now regression testing is nothing but testing the unchanged feature of an application to make sure that changes like adding a feature deleting a feature modification done or fixing a defect is not impacting the unchanged feature of an application that is called as regression testing so this is all about black box testing and in case you guys have still some questions put out your all your doubt in the comment section i will be really happy to explain each and every doubt that you guys are having directly to your comment section if you guys want to reach to me out i have added my core account twitter account g all my social media account in the link description please check it out reach me anywhere you can expect a reply within one hour and in next video what shall i make next put out in the comment section i will be surely picking your topic and i will be making that video so this is all about from this video thank you guys